I don't know why the amp meter is not working currently. Yesterday I tested it and it was still working. Anyway, the point is that it reached the temperature you want. And now you can either lower it while you are working. It will lower it by 10. It will relatively quickly do it, or just plus 20 level, then it will do. Or if you push the middle one, it will enter the boost mode and hold the temperature right there. If you push it again, or the timer will expire, then it will go back after a few seconds. Okay, let's try to put a little solder on the tip. What I really like about this, my, the default tip is very good. So I'm using it for a few weeks now and trying to always clip it clean. But the default tip is very, very good. It's still um, melting the solder, how it should, and keeping it there. And the other ones that I bought for, uh, this was just a few USD. Obviously not original tips, but still after a few use, and even though I'm keeping them clean, it will be very, very difficult for them to to melt the solder after a while. Even if I'm always trying to keep it clean and things like that, it will um, go bad relatively quickly. I bought three uh, tips for the other type, the T12, but I don't recommend buying a uh, very cheap one for a few USD because this one will definitely go bad very quickly and you won't be able to use it. But the default one is, uh, is a really good one. Okay. Anyway, I uh, won't do further testing for now. I just wanted to introduce this one and uh, I hope you will like it. And maybe later I will do some more testing with this one or with other devices because I have a few other things that I just didn't find any review about them anywhere else. So maybe I will do that. Anyway, as the last uh, part, we can try to replace the head while using. Uh, if you want to turn this off, the only thing I found was if you just pull this cable off. So I didn't find any comment to turn it off. But anyway, so this one is still super hot. I won't touch it, of course. But this part is, uh, is not hot at all. You can start to unscrew it. And the secret is, let's try to pull it out slowly, like this, and then this part you can touch, it's not hot at all, okay, and it will of course the temperature right here to zero, and then say that it's an error because it can't find the head, but it's okay, and then you can try to place the other head in, Like that, it will ask you to select the tip. I only have one, so it's okay. And it starts heating it up immediately. Okay. And this one is even easier to replace because you just unscrew it, take it out. And then, what you have to look for is this part is also cold. Don't worry about it. Slowly pull it back. And then this part is also not hot. So you can just touch it. And then 
pull it down like that. And then now you can replace the head with another one while working. It's easy, you don't have to wait for it to cool down. Just don't touch the upper part. Unless you want to have nice red fingers. Anyway, that's it for today. Goodbye, guys.